Joshua vs. Pulev undercard full details as Katie Taylor and Kali Afai both feature. Joshua is in pursuit of win no 20 after beating Vladimir Klitschko in an epic fight earlier this year. The Brit is the heavyweight division's most valuable asset now and is lining up a unification fight with Deontay Wilder. But first he must beat his IBF mandatory challenger Pulev, whose only professional defeat came against Klitschko himself. The Principality Stadium is expected to be packed for the fight and they will also be treated to an undercard of his quality. The last time Yafai fought on an Anthony Joshua undercard, when the heavyweight smashed Eric Molina, he won his world title for the first time. The Birmingham fighter produced a masterful display to outbox Luis Concepcion in Manchester and successfully defended the strap in his hometown in May. Now he faces unbeaten Japanese fighter Ishita, who has never fought outside of his home country but comes highly rated. The Commonwealth heavyweight belt has already been on the line once between these two and Jamaica's Thomas was a humble but worthy winner over the ever game David Allen. The judges gave Thomas a split decision on the night which earned Allen a rematch and his gracious opponent was happy to oblige. It promises to be another tight affair. Buglini has ramped up the intensity of this bout, but it hardly needed it. The defending British champion has been tweeting trash talk and promising a comprehensive victory on the night. Johnson's trainer Joe Gallagher has hit back at what he sees as undue arrogance from the champion. I see some of the trash talk Frank has been putting out on Twitter, Gallagher told Sky Sports. I think he must still be concussed from that fight because he's forgotten the 11 rounds before it when he got his head boxed off, when he beat Hosea Burton with a late stoppage to claim the British title. He landed a right hand with a minute to go in the 12th round and he's going on like he beat Hosea up for every minute of every round. Katie Taylor is one of Ireland's most popular boxers and is the leading professional woman perhaps in the world. After six professional wins, she will get her first world title shot against Sanchez who boasts a record of 17-2 but is fighting in the UK for 